In this unit, we get to the essence of storytelling. The great writer Joan Didion once said, we tell stories to make sense of the world. And this is what we're going to explore in this, in this unit. Pretty much every story that you'll ever encounter has some sort of problem to solve for the main character, the protagonist. That's also called conflict. And without conflict, it's really a boring story because you read the story with kind of the feeling inside, what would I do if I was the character, if I was faced with these conflicts? What kind of decisions would I make? Conflicts can be internal conflicts. Inside your mind, what are you thinking? How am I going to make a moral choice? Or how am I going to make an ethical choice to deal with this problem? There could be external conflict too. That's more like a fight scene or car chase scene or something like that. And something happens in the environment, the protagonist, the main person in the story has to deal with the conflict. What I'd like you to do as somebody who is analyzing a story is look at how the author presents conflict. Look at how the author positions the main character and even the side characters to deal with and solve the problems. That's going to be your job as a writer to decide whether the author does a good job or a bad job of in inserting conflict into the story and then showing how the characters solve the conflict. By the way, often this is part of theme development because you learn about moral choices. You learn about what you would do yourself if you're watching a movie or reading a book. Somebody is presented with these conflicts, with these challenges. How would you solve those? That's the theme to the story. Now I have this all written up, so go ahead and read what I have here in this page, but I think sometimes it helps to have it verbally explained as well as reading. So go and explore conflict in your stories and come back in the discussion threads and tell me what you think.